All right, hey everybody, Cassandra and I are out here shooting our prime bows. Um, we just kind of want to give you guys our first impressions and thoughts. This year I am shooting a Prime Logic in the CT CT3 um, 33 inch axle to axle and my arrow setup is I'm going to 20 grains lighter than last year so I'm shooting a 550 grain arrow um, but way more accurate so Sonner what are you shooting this year I have the prime logic as well but the most important piece is in the elevated two camo which I love I mean I went from a Matthews jewel and honestly I was a little bit nervous this is a little bit of a heavier bow when I first held it but the reality is once you actually draw back that tension I mean it goes away that let off is incredible and that weight dispersion is amazing I feel like I'm way more accurate I'm shooting about a 420 green arrow but way more accurate with this bone I think honestly probably because that weight is more stable Definitely. Let's go check it out. Yeah, we're gonna get shooting. <laughs> The Prime Logic 31 inches axle to axle, IBO of 330 feet per second, 7 inch brace height, 24 and a half to 30 inch draw lengths, 4.3 pounds out of the box, and then 40 to 80 pound draw weight. Overall first impression, love the bow. Honestly, the back wall is just solid and I love the limb stops. I feel like I can hold for a really, really long time. I'm really accurate with this, probably because it is a heavier bow that I'm not swaying so much. So I'm shooting really tight groupings and I literally just set it in tonight and already at 40 dialing it into a couple inches. So looking forward to continuing getting this dialed in, but overall it doesn't just look good, it actually works well too. Prime Logic CT3, 33 inch axle to axle. IBO of 335 feet per second, six and a half inch brace height, 24 and a half to 30 inch draw length, 4.4 pounds out of the box, and 40 to 80 pound draw weights. Okay. Overall, first initial impress impressions are money. Love it. Um, the other really cool thing that Prime does is they have so many options as far as colors. I went with, I think it's called the Morel Green, something like that. Cassandra hates it just because it doesn't match my camouflage, but um, I just love the solids and the finish is absolutely great. Um, same as what Cassandra said, the back wall is, is solid and when I'm at full draw, I'm just holding so steady. Um, limb stops compared to my last bow, um, it, I, I, I just don't like the sponginess of the cable stops and this is just I mean, it is rock solid. Um, and the center grip technology, uh, the bow just, it just sits in your hand and is so well balanced. Um, they're, they're just, they're money. Um, and I, and that's what they pride themselves on at Prime is how accurate their bows are. And they nailed it. This, <laughs> this thing is awesome. I, first arrow I shot at 50 yards, I was within an inch of what I was aiming at. So, um, 
just getting them dialed in. I can't wait to shoot a turkey in the head with this in a couple weeks or a week or two, whatever it is. Um, but overall, impressed. Get out to your local dealerships, sight them in. Uh, we went up to Long Range Archery in Dillon, hooked us up, got our bows dialed in. If you're ever up in the um, Grand Rapids type area, Holland is where they're located. Get in there, get your hands on one of these, or the Logic, CT3, CT5, or the 9, any of them. They're just a solid shooting bow. Get out there, shoot a prime, you're gonna love it.